Okay guys, Dave Wurst, don't forget to like and subscribe on the Dave Wurst Pickleball channel. This video is going to be about, uh, do, I keep, uh, do I keep my eye on the ball or do I not keep my eye on the ball? I had a great question, uh, somebody brought in a question and uh, I'm going to answer this question for you. So stay tuned for this video, it's going to help you. Dave Wurst Pickleball channel. Uh, today I'm going to uh, show you or uh, explain to you also is uh, well, I had a question and uh, what you know should I keep my eye on the ball when I hit the hit the pickleball and uh, you know people go oh you got to keep your eye on the on the ball uh, first and stuff and uh, that's not exactly true uh, you know you're you got two eyes you got one eye looking at the ball and you have to have one other eye to look at your opponent moving because if i stood there and looked at uh, the ball i wouldn't know where to hit the ball in my opponent because my opponent i can't read where he's standing so uh, the myth is oh keep your eye on the ball you, you have two eyes you can do it if you if you close one of your eyes and try to do it then you'll then you'll realize you know uh you know that uh, you can only use one eye for uh, get the ball uh, hitting the ball with uh, with your eye and stuff but with two eyes you got uh, you can see the ball and see where the person is so here we go we're going to demonstrate uh, you know uh, keeping you uh, you don't have to keep your eye on the ball so here we go and uh, here we go for the video okay Dave feed me some balls I'm gonna show you uh, you know how I'm going to keep my eye on the ball and hit the ball and try to look at my form. I probably won't be able to see him, but I'm just doing an example. Here we go. Okay, so, so that example there is, uh, I was keeping my eye on the ball, but when I keep my eye on the ball, uh, as soon as I hit it, then I'm able to see where Dave is at, where I'm hitting it. I have to look to see where my opponent is first, so I know where to hit the open spot. So that was a good example right there of just looking at the ball. So now you want to focus on looking at the ball, looking at your opponent. And uh, also, I'll, I'll go to the third one very soon here. Okay, so here we go. So on this one, I'm focusing on my eyes, both of them. I'm focusing on Dave. Go ahead. I'm focusing on the pickleball. And I'm trying to go ahead. And so I'm trying to focus on uh, Dave and the pickleball. So we're we'll do this. So here's another theory. You always see players put their head down when you when you hit uh, the pickleball and they don't lift it up and people figure oh that's going to be um, you know he's keeping his eye on the ball no uh, that's not exactly true uh, I, uh, I did it in handball uh, and I do this in tennis and I notice what the uh, in pickleball also and I notice this technique is basically what I'm trying to do if I keep my head down I can I can trick the uh, the person and not knowing where I hit it. If I, you know, I get a, here, give me a shot. I'm gonna try to keep my head down and I'm gonna try to hit it and he won't probably know where it's gonna go, hopefully. One more. So, so on this one here, I kept my head down Try not to have him read my eyes on what where I'm going to hit it. So if I hit and keep my head up, the, the your opponent can see exactly where you're hitting the ball, and you can't really fake the ball. So I'm going to hit it. I'm going to keep my head up and still have the same swing. Here we go. Whoop, a little harder. Okay, so 
So there's a good example of keeping my head up and hitting the ball. And my opponent could see exactly my eyes where I'm hitting it. So that's how you explain, should I keep my eye on the ball or should I not keep my eye on the ball? Uh, basically, if you have two eyes, you're good. You're automatically keeping your eye on the ball. And the only reason why you keep your head down and swing through is to uh, throw your opponent off because they're looking at your upper body on hitting it. And if I'm going like this and I uh, hit it over to that side, they can't read it. So we do this in tennis. We do this in handball. And, uh, and that's to, to explain that myth about keeping your eye on the ball. So please subscribe to the Dave Worst channel. And hopefully uh, you'll like this uh, pickleball uh, lesson about keeping your eye on the ball.